back in our video. Pixel Gamer is recording, and this is our new Nigerian. We're fucked. His name is Buddy. Um, his name is Buddy, and we, his name was Todd, but we didn't really like that, so we changed it. So we're going to be this one with our mini new band, way over there in the pallet fence. Yeah! And the Niger yeah! And the dwarf Nigerian sister. Um, pipe down. And, uh, Okay, so that's Shannon. Now I'm going to show you the rabbit colony that we buy for my brother and um, well, my whole family, somebody's... Pixel Gamer, uh, helping me do. So this is it. We used to have them in cages. Press in, please. Pipe down. Um, so we used to have them in all these uh, over there. Um, yes, don't. What, what are you doing with that? Uh, whatever. So, we had them used to be in cages, and we had them used to water and feed every cage, and we have around probably, let's see, almost 30 rabbits. So, that's a lot to do. We have to open each cage, which is, it's not hard, but it adds up. So, so yeah, please. I want to hold the button. Yeah, you can hold the button. Um, yes, okay. Uh, there's a lot of stuff going on because we're just selling something, or watching the rabbit and this is a new place and we have everyone out here. A lot of stuff going on. And so we had to give each rabbit three things. Water, food, and hay. And then so we and we oh yes yeah, actually please focus. Um and then we had to go to each cage. And as I said we have around thirty rabbits. So yes. Three. Okay. And now we're gonna go in here and I'm just show you sorry for all the talk and just the information that you thought it was on. So yeah, I am the narrator. You, uh, Rocky, please stay. There's Rocky. He's a good so boy. this is just the rabbit? So, uh, these are the all the males. And he's we a have new, uh, Florida White, Flemish, Zalia, please stop. Like, uh, and we have, what's it called, uh, Lionhead, and we have, uh, Flemish Giant Buck. So we have two Flemish so Giants in here. That's one of them, and then that gray one, and then we have one. We only have a we have we have a breeding pair of Florida whites. This is the other one. The females over there, which we'll show you. Oh my gosh! And then uh, so we have there's one. There's the buck. Look at the uh, New Zealand, and then, yep, that's the buck lion head. And then yeah. Uh, yep. So that's all we have in here. We just did this probably within three days. Hi. So I'll show you how we did this so they're not get out. So as you can see, it's all new dirt that we just put down. What we did is we had this little wire right here, right here. Okay, so yeah, please. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, and then what we did is we it comes out to about right here, and then we buried it all up. Bucky, and no. they just not even digging in it, which is good that we put that down. As as you can see, if you could, there's little holes everywhere, like there and there, which we'll clean up later. Yeah, we can keep going over here. I'll show you all the cleaning over here. Are you gonna come over? Yeah. Okay. Here, would you like me to grab your camera? Hi, we're back with this camera by cameraman. And then, so this is Zurich, my brother. Hi. Uh, he's I helped 10. Him build it. He helped me build Andy. it. He was Dick. So you can see the giant hole over there. I helped. That's what we did. Yes, I know, Zelia. Um, so that's where we got a lot of the dirt, and we got some more places too. We're all uh -huh. behind the bar here a little bit. So this is my sister, Zalia. She is seven. She helped too. And then, so all right here is we have, um, kind of basically. So the rabbits, they can come up here and they can climb up and stay right there. And what they really can do is what we really built this for, so they could dig in the middle and make a nest. And what this There's is kind of, in there. I know. Like that. So what this, this is basically it's the top. So what they they'll do is they'll get down, they'll dig out a hole, and then they'll go. They might start to dig into the ground, but then the top is. Their, their roof basically. So then their house will basically be under the ground and this is this is for when they if they just want to dig down and if uh, when they're having their baby. So Leah, please stop. It's and then we have a hay bale in here so they can pick up hay to make nests and just to eat it. We have some trees so they can rub their faces and do what rabbits do on trees. And we have No. Um, so this is one of our, our Florida white female. 
She's kept, she's ready. She has a little ear problem with we're doing in an eye problem. Um, but what it is is it's a cat litter box and we just cut off the long part, the uh, thick part, and we put a little hay down or they make it themselves. And then um, we just basically put it down and then they use it. So they put stuff. And if you're new and you're not subscribed, hit that bell and subscribe, please. Or, uh, I can't believe we hit 100 subscribers. Thank you guys so much for uh, being here since the beginning. So then we have the, so the, um, what's it called? I don't know what the color is called, but that male right there, the buck, and that one. Those two are a breeding pair. We got them from the, uh, a guy in Sioux City. Hey, uh, did you know that that guy? Which way? Hi, back again. Uh, so we have all these rabbits in here. Okay, Sissy. Oh, and then this is what we're going to do right now, and I'm going to show you another one of our new animals. Three. Hi, guys. We're back out of the rabbit colony because uh, I wanted to show you one of our new animals. I have a master pet walking back through yet. But there's the goat of Buddy and his favorite kind of hay. Say hi. Hi. Now we can keep going back here. I can show you our other sheep. So. Open to, I can tell you about what we've been doing today. So lately we've been getting some cattle gates in our trailer. We just bought that trailer probably a couple of months ago. I don't think I've had anything yet on, on it. Uh, but we've got uh, some cattle gates in our trailer. Then we have some cattle gates in our trailer. Then we've got a female suffix we saying. Is there suffix? Well, we don't really know the baby, but we think it's a suffix because we have the suffix boy over there. And we can do a new update on him uh, in a little bit. But, um... I can show you her, then we can walk up there and see. Uh, my sister's Aaliyah, calls her Cupcake, which... She doesn't know her name yet, but that's how you teach them. Keep saying it. So this is her. She's really light. She's probably a little bit underweight. We're going to save her from the seal. She's really cute. She's fluffy, fluffy, fluffy. Yeah, good. And we have a lot of our new animals out on leashes with the collar because it's really easy to let them graze. And if they're old enough, uh, they can stay out a lot of the time because they can protect themselves and they can get oh out. So uh, since I already have a video, I can give you guys an update on all of the animals. Why not? Rocky, 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 you want to be on YouTube? So this is, um, we, we sold the other one. Oh, boy. Right there. So we sold the other one because uh, we didn't really need to. Uh, so this is Lover Boy, that's what we named him. He's really nice. We let him out on a leash every day. He has a collar. And then, so we usually tie him around somewhere there or about over there by the girl's fence. And then you can see some of them walking. So what we're going to do is we're this, this this Christmas or a little bit before. Um, and then uh, but a little bit before Christmas, we're going to breed sheep and the goats. We can do that because the goats are not old, old enough yet. So we can do... Uh, so, uh, if you will, we, uh, I'm going to show I'm going to pause the video and then I'm going to walk up to the chicken coop so I can show you. Bye. Hi, guys. Back here at the chicken coop. Just trying to let the dog in. So you can come in here. I'm going to give you a new tour of the uh, update on the chicken coops. So I just please wait so we can do it on video. Just so they can see our, our uh, how we do it. So we can walk over here. So this is where they can walk around and look for stuff. It's, it's really well, it's not really dry, but some parts are because we had to wash out a little bit. And then uh, so we have a mulberry tree over here, which they like when there's mulberries, so they fall down for them to eat. And when they leave, they have to eat that. Yes, ladies. And as you can see, some things are starting to pop up. It's false. Not really useful. Yes, Leah, please. Yes, Leah, please. Wait. Okay, now we can walk over here. I'll show you the rest. So there's one of our new silky roosters. And then you have this. Over here. So this, uh, so please wait so we can go on a video. You can. So this 
is the coop that's DIY. It's not too perfect or anything. Because they're chickens, they don't need it. No! So you want to come in, Ryan? I can't because you're probably too big. I'm too tall. Okay. Okay, so this is it back here. It's Leah. And then uh, we use these for also chicken things. We fill them with hay or mulch. Oh, no. That, you don't have to call the chickens in here. And there. Yeah, chicky, this, chicky, chicky. We'll get them in a little bit. So this is what they usually lay all the eggs in. You can see there's a boatload. We collect the eggs about once every day. So it's about the time where we can collect all these eggs. Yeah, we'll, we'll get them in a little bit. So that's our chicken coop. And then he will keep recording. Pixel Gamer. Now we can go to the sheep. There's only one! Oh, it doesn't really matter. We can just keep... Okay. Oh, my God. So, as you can see right here, we have the chicken thief. The chicken feed thief. She's a really nice one. She'll just come up and eat anything. See, as you can see in here... I'll take the camera and show them. Yes, you can't. There's the chicken feed down there. Oh, that's gross. Okay, that's the gross stuff. But you can still give it to them because they'll... Some chickens will eat anything. Okay, back. Rocky, Rocky. Show everyone that you're still really good. Good boy. Good boy. Oh, good boy. He's a good boy. He's been good. He's been helping herd the sheep and everything. Now, so once in a while we open the cans and give them to the chickens. Um, this is the thing. the sheep like to hide under these things. It's a land. And then, you know, some of the water, so wait till you get in here. This is moss. There's, there's a lot of gross stuff that we, it's about time to clean them out again. So we, we do it about once every week. And there's our minerals, the salt. And here's their, uh, this is what we feed them at night, and then we usually put some hay bales in here, or we usually put hay bales in here. Oh, and yeah. And then this is where at nighttime they usually like to lay. And oh, it's kind of tangled, but usually Rocky likes to sleep out here. Uh, so what we do is he likes to sleep with the sheep. It's a really good. He's a really good uh, protector for them, and he's bonded with the and he's bonded with them really well. We this say we tie him to this end, then he stays out here in the morning, we let him off, but we're gonna do all the feeding stuff. Puppies! Hey guys, uh, just have a good nice day. Bye.